Hello, hello, we have returned with, we are doing a TikTok react, a scenario react kind of vibe. I'm going to show um, Marina a TikTok story time. Okay. I guess it should be a excited. story time reaction. Okay. And um, we're just going to react because when I saw it, I found it funny. And I was yeah. just like, oh, what are you doing said moment? Um, so, without further ado, I think it's called the Lemon, Lemon Chronicles or Lemon Face something. Lemon? She's literally, this is, hold on. Turn your brightness up already, please. Yeah. Yes. This, this is always a struggle. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So much to unpack here. First of all, how could she not rem remember his name considering it's the same name as her dad's? I know. Like, surely if I met someone... Oh, if I met someone with my dad's name, I'd be like, mm. Yeah, I would really hate that. I, would, I don't think I could forget it. I'd really hate it. Yeah, and it's like... But, but I want to mention, right, yeah. she obviously said that she went back and then she was, they were doing the deed and then he was like, say my name. And I'm like, yeah, that's no. That's first no. of all, that's no. I feel like that's fake. I feel like, not, not fake, but who asks for that? Yeah. What for? Say my name. That's so creepy. Why? That's giving Jeffrey Dharma. Isn't it? Like, like just slightly. Why, why, why are you asking me this? Yeah. Do you have amnesia? What is the purpose? Like, I personally, I'm like, when people say that, oh, he's say my name, I'm like, you've yeah. watched way too many movies. That's because so what crazy. is that doing for you? But oh god, that is traumatizing. Imagine, and he, the way he was like, I thought you were into I, that. Mm, I thought you were into it. You have my mum's name. I thought you were into Yuck. it. Ugh. What the fuck? Why? Oh my yeah. god! 
I love the like lemon thing. She does all of her story time. Oh, is it? One that... Have you seen the statue one? The guy mm-hmm. who's like a statue. He's like, oh my god, he's so funny. I love him. She has another one. I think most of her stories are sex based because the yeah. other one is sex based too. But she does all of her stories like that, like yeah. in a lemon. I guess she doesn't want anyone to know. I don't know. But she yeah. has some some interesting experiences. Really? Yes. What's that name again? Um, I think it's Lemon Lady Secrets. <laughs> Love it. And no one knows who she is. No one knows. I mean, I haven't been on her page like that. But is it just all lemon? Yeah. Basically. Oh snap! Okay. Oh my god, that's hilarious though. She is your main squeeze. <laughs> Oh my god, I love it. That is so funny. She's but oh my god, let's try and chime in. How does she go that long though? How does she honestly play like, it off? I feel like if I'm on a date and I'm like, fuck, I forgot your name, I'd be like, yeah, listen, I'd have to just. I honest. forgot your name. Sorry. Yeah. It was. I was wondering, like, what would you? How would you try and get him to say his name without being bait? You know what I do? I saw this actually on TikTok. <laughs> I was going to do the, the TikTok line and say, oh, I read it, but no, I didn't. Um, I would say, do you know, it's really, um, only 10% of people can say their name really fast four times. Oh, that's a good one. And are you part of the 10%? Have you ever done it? Yeah, do it. Do it now. Do it. I'll do it. I'll go first. <laughs> yeah. And then you go. <laughs> I'll do something like that. That is so, so because good. It's like, sometimes it's like, oh, I don't want to be like, oh, I forgot your name. But yeah. it's like, sometimes I do. Yeah, but I just don't think, like, fair enough, I get she was, you know, cornered. <laughs> when he was like, say my name, say my name. She had to be honest. But I'm like, I think I would genuinely fake a seizure. Yeah. Pretend like I'm going to vomit. Like, just Something. do anything to get out of that moment. And then figure out, right, I need to know his name I'd in case this happens again. I would say, what would I say? I'd just, I'd, I'd call on God. I'd, I don't know what I'd say. I don't know what I'd do. Yeah. I don't know what I'd do. I'd be like, <laughs> why? What's happening here? Like, what do you do okay. in, that, in that moment? I mean, I, I rate her for being honest and being yeah. like, listen, I don't know your name. Yeah. What is your name? But then it's like, in that moment, you hear your, your father's name. Yeah, no. Ew. No, that's so nice. And so he clearly was like saying her name so much because he was thinking of his fucking mum. What? Just, I need, I mean, I'm, I'm not trying to judge no one, okay? But I just genuinely want to understand how on earth that could be a turn on. Please. Which screw is loose and where? Exactly. And what makes you think that after this is done and you go home and you say your mum's name, that that's not going to pop into your head. Like you've just been screaming out her name for next year and you were turned on by that. Yeah. Ew. Yuck. Ew. David. Ew. (laughs) I barely want to date the guy the same nationality as before. (laughs) So, (laughs) name? Yeah, no, that is... Ew not trying to judge no one out there. If that's your thing, happy for you in it. Random. But it also comes into play, like, you know Tyler, Taylor, Taylor Lautner? Yeah. You know he married a girl called Taylor, Taylor, yeah. And now they both have the same name. Oh, yeah, shit. So they're both Taylor Lautner. Taylor Taylor Lautner or something. Whatever his name is. Yeah. Why? That's, what do you do? They must use nicknames, but like, what if, if you're getting a parcel? Like, like how yeah. are you gonna know? How do you know which one's who's? Yeah, I would change my name. Why well, would hyphenate my name? But I wouldn't change. Yeah, it. I'd be like, it's it's stupid. Why are we gonna have the same name? Yeah. Oh my god, that's crazy. Why would you do that? that like, what if she wild? What if you both have a doctor's appointment? Yeah. <laughs> and it's like Taylor Lord now. Yeah. Like yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like a male one. Or a female one. Yeah. Oh my god, that is... I think they did it probably for, like, fans and for it to be something cool, but... Yeah. Yeah, that just... 
that was just one of those stories I was just like yeah that was funny that yeah. funny but also very disturbing mm. I didn't I don't know how I feel about it it makes me concerned that there are men out there that get turned on by like parent stuff yeah I find that very disturbing I'm like what what kind of therapy do you need yeah because so not normal I just like I'm trying I'm certainly trying to understand how like were you neglected as a child like and this is not me even trying to, i'm genuinely not trying to be funny here i'm not trying to like insult no one i'm just genuinely trying to understand no, like trying to understand. is it was that the reason when you neglected do you what are you craving attention like do you, did you not grow up with a mom hmm. do you hate your mother yeah like ew honestly <sighs> I can't even pinch on myself in that situation. Like, I think yeah. if I fell in love with someone and they had the same name as my dad, I'd be like, you, I cannot call you that. Yeah. I would never call you that. Yeah. I'd call you something else. I'd literally change your name. Mm. You'd have to give them a pet name or something. I'd or just to. say babe or something. I'd have to. I'd call you whatever I wanted to. I'd call you yeah. Chris if I needed to. <laughs> I'm not calling you my name. I am changing your name. So why does she call you that? She refuses to call yeah. my name. Well, that was... That was interesting. It was interesting. It was an interesting it's one. Like I'm keen to see more of this There's stuff. so many more. Is there another favourite? There is. Maybe I we just do another one. I just... I'm trying to figure out... Because I know I liked it. I started getting laser hair removal. Um, essentially all over my entire body. Okay. And so... When they do your front downstairs, they're gonna do your back downstairs, okay? And when they do your back downstairs, they make you spread them. I don't like do I, I don't <laughs> like doing that. Like essentially, like I've been there at this point probably twelve or thirteen times. That means twelve to thirteen more women have seen my bubble than than men have. It's just that just throw it out on the table for you. So because I don't like to spread them. I will just let the lady kind of just like go in there blind and uh so this this one of these last times she went in there blind didn't know where she was shooting shot it right into my butthole <laughs> right into my butthole when i tell you the scream in which i scrapped <laughs> i swear to god the laser shot right out of my mouth <laughs> think about that because like I feel like people that do those kind of jobs mm -hmm. like um, laser wax um, laser and waxing I'm like yeah do you have like a stiff drink after the I day know, because like, that's I don't know how they can do it honestly mm. so buzz. like it's something that I'm like oh my god it's so unflattering and then you sit there and then you're the one just there and i remember this one girl i worked with she asked her um wax lady she was like how do you deal with seeing just yeah vag every day yeah and she was like mm, i just don't i don't see them as like vaginas anymore i just see them as potatoes and she's like potatoes? um that's so random i'm like what how do you get from a to a potato yeah don't do that to potatoes in the head but yeah, that buzz. that one. Oh my god! How do you? How do you? Oh my god! Can you imagine the pain? I'm the going. Scream! I screamed. <laughs> I'm so going funny. like in a medical aspect. I'm like, what did you laser? Yeah, for it to hurt like that. Yeah, like what area did you laser? Because there's something you t you hit. Yeah. 
Let's stop this. No. How are you going to let her go in blind, though? Just do the thing. Yeah. Like... Just you know, for a reason, exactly. so I can spread it, get it over with, and exactly. just live do it, your life. Do it properly. And I'm surprised they didn't say, like, no, you need to yeah, spread. Yeah, you need to spread. Yeah, she should have said, no, you need to spread, because otherwise I'm going to shoot up your ass. Exactly. <laughs> what? That's... How are you going to do that? Yeah. God, that's traumatising. I want to do it, but I'm like... <sighs> it's just... It's long. It's long. It's such a chore. And you have to go back for a while. Yeah. But I've heard that it does work. Of course. I, I have. It's got to get it done. Should we do it together? I think we should. <laughs> like, obviously not the same room. No, but like, the same... Yeah, go same and make, it make it quick. It will make it a little, a little more, like, enjoyable. Because, honestly, I, I, I feel fun. like my... I feel like I'm going to need you to drag me. Oh, for sure. Because... Especially, you're like, oh, I don't want to go again. For the first time, if it's like discomfort, if you feel discomfort, then I know you're not going to want to go back. Yeah. I'll have to firm it though, because it lasts like a lifetime. Yeah. And it's like, at least I'm getting a benefit long term. Yes. I feel like I, I want to look into it because yeah. waxing is something that is... It needs to end. To needs to end. Needs to. Yeah. But there, ne- there needs to be, like, a different resolve. Mm. Have you ever epilated? You know that thing that's, like, it's a mach- this machine that sort of rolls, and it's essentially, like, thousands of little um, tweezers plucking your hairs. No! It's, it's basically, it's like a mix of tweezing and waxing, because it's so fast that it feels like waxing, but it pinches you... You know, like when you're getting your brows like mm-hmm. um, plucked or yeah. something, mm-hmm. it's like that. It's one of the worst experiences I've ever. I've injured. never epilated. I wouldn't. Re- I wouldn't recommend it. No. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend it. I can barely sit through a wax. Yeah. Less alone, multiple little tweezers. Like I mean, I tweeze my eyebrows, but yeah. that's just that's easy. Yeah, it's only a few hairs. But no. Yeah. <laughs> Mm. No, that's scary. <laughs> Honestly, I envy guys for just Literally having their hair. just living with a bush, exactly. like hairy legs, hairy arms. Yeah, hairy armpits. They just don't care. <sighs> so oh, God, I'm so jealous. I won't add that to my list of reasons I'm irritated by men. <laughs> Okay, right. Anyways, um, so I guess that brings us to the end of this little scenario video. Hope you guys enjoyed and uh, make sure you let us know if you know any other funny TikTokers that we can watch. Yes. And uh, we'll leave the lemon lady. The lemon lady secrets. Yeah, lemon we'll leave her secrets. somewhere on the screen. And, she is um, funny. Yeah, I definitely want to watch like more of her videos. I want to find the other one. I just... I don't. I know yeah. I, I liked it, but I just have to search. Okay. All right. Well, um, we will catch you next week. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, all of that good stuff, and see you next week. Bye. Bye.